Hello students, how are you all? Hope you all are happy and healthy. We are doing Maths Magic Workbook, Chapter 11, Area and its Boundary. Today I am going to explain you question number 12. Because in my last video I already completed this chapter till question number 11. So hope you all have workbook, open your workbook and see on page number 156. Concentrate here. Draw three rectangles with different size in the square sheet given here. This is the square sheet given here. We have to draw three rectangles with a different size. In such a way that area of each rectangle becomes 12 square centimeter. On this basis completed the following tables. This basis area of 1 square centimeter is equal to 1 square centimeter. So here you have to notice student, we have to draw three rectangles with the different size. But that's all rectangle, we have to cover the area only 12 square centimeter, not less, not more than 12. Only area will come on 12 square centimeter with a different rectangle we have to draw in different size. So first you have to see here, I already drawn here, 6 centimeter I took here. Length and 2 cm is breadth. So 6, 2. And then after, here you have to notice what is the formula of area. Area is equal to length multiply with breadth. So 6 multiply with 2. How will come? 6, 2 is 12. So 12 square cm is complete. So like this first you have to draw. Then see the second one. Here is length is 3 cm and the breadth is 4 cm. Now it's a different between though these two. This is different and this is also different. But area is equal. 3 multiplied with 12. 4. That is it come 12 square centimeter. 3 multiplied with 4. 3 4 is 12. So area is 12 square centimeter. Because the formula is area is length multiplied with breadth. Now see the third now this is the third one. Okay. Here also I took here 1 cm. The length and the breadth is 12 cm. Because all this we have to take a different measurement with a rectangle. Different way that we have to draw. But the area will come only 12 cent square cm. So 1 multiply with length multiply with breadth. That is 1 multiply with 12 cm. It will come area 12 square cm. Now see. Here, now notice here student, area is all, area is a square, 12 square centimeter we drawn because according to question that we have to draw. But we have to find out the length, breadth and the perimeter. So see the first one, 6 is, 6 centimeter is length, then breadth is 2 centimeter, here also 2. Okay, rectangle because 2 side will equal. 2 cm and the perimeter. What is the formula of perimeter? 2 multiply with length plus breadth. So 6 plus 2 is equal to 8. 8 multiply with 8 multiply with 2. 8 to the 16. So 16 cm is your perimeter. Now see the third one. Third is the 3 cm is length and 4 cm is breadth. And the square is same because according to your question, question may Diya hua hai ki 12 square centimeter sabka area hona chahiye. All the map. So according to this your question. And then perimeter. Put the perimeter formula. 3 plus 4 multiply. 3 plus 4. 7. 7 multiply with 2. 14 centimeter is your perimeter. Now see the third one. Length and breadth. 1 centimeter and 12 centimeter. So 1 plus 12. 13. 13 multiply with 2. This is the perimeter formula. 2 plus length plus breadth. So 13 multiply with 2, 26 centimeter is your answer according to this your <laughs> sheet. Okay. So this is the three rectangle with a different size. And all the rectangle have the equal 12 square centimeter measurement of area. And breadth and length also we find out. We Draw the perimeter also. So like this you have to draw in a different way. And then after you have to write here length, breadth, area and the perimeter. 
hope you all understood this practice it and complete your workbook whenever you are going to draw anything draw with the help of pencil only don't use